So, um, I have been meaning to make a video on all the things I've sold on eBay, and I keep forgetting to do it before I package them up. So I thought today, to get started, I would just do a quick top 10 my favorite sales of the last month. Now this one is actually something that I just sold today and just packaged up, and it's a little tiny alarm clock. It's only about, I don't know, three, four inches tall. It was a, um a wind-up alarm clock and the alarm would get stuck it wouldn't really work really well unless you kind of helped it along so it was kind of broken but it still sold for $25 all right this one is a glass kind of a jade colored glass punch bowl set came with 18 glasses which was incredible we found this in a storage unit that we had purchased at an auction. It had a little stand and it sold for $55 plus shipping. This one was a teak letter tray, kind of a desk organizer. It fits a like a you know standard size of paper. It was made by Kalmar Designs. I paid two dollars for this at a, at a thrift store and it sold fairly quickly for $40. This was a cool one, and this was actually something that I found while I was on vacation. It was a flight sim yoke, like joystick. It was brand new, unopened. They had it for five bucks. I grabbed it. It sold within a couple weeks for a hundred and twenty dollars. This is a teapot and salt shaker set. It is made by Sango. We found this in a storage unit, and it sold for $65. This is a vintage Stetson hat. Oh, it's not focusing at all. Um, this was purchased by somebody in London, actually, and they paid, I think, $24 to have it shipped to London, and it sold for $30. This is a pitcher. It's a depression glass, this amber colored Beverly design. We purchased a huge box of this design glass at an auction for I think $41. It had about 50 pieces in it, approximately. This is the first one that has sold after I got them all listed and it sold for $75. So I'm pretty happy about that purchase of the, the lot. Um, my kids have these Thomas a train plastic sets and, um, you know, they weren't really playing with them. So I started grouping them up into lots and selling them and I realized very quickly how valuable they really were, um, and how well they kept their value. This right here was a lot that I found at a thrift store in a bag for $7. Um, I believe there was 70 pieces in there and they sold for $50. This was a cool one. It was a um, a grab bag at the Goodwill, and I think it was marked three or four dollars. And it had a bunch of junk in it, some little figurines and stuff. And these were in there. This is what I was really interested in. And they are uh, magnetic massage balls made by Magboy. And I think it's a company um, Nikon, Nikon or whatever it's called. And these sold for sixty dollars. And then here is a pair of Juicy Couture um, eyeglasses. These are prescription eyeglasses that somebody will have to put their own prescription in. I buy these all the time. Whenever I find them, I buy them for a dollar or two. I buy the cases for a dollar or two. I sell them all the time, as you will see. And I think I paid three dollars for this set, and they sold for fifty dollars. So that's my top ten from February. And I'll do another video soon. Thanks for watching.